Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today from Good Housekeeping's book of breads and sandwiches of 1958, we're going to be making the two-course sandwich. And those of you uh, familiar with the Cornish pasty will understand where the inspiration came from. The first thing we have to do is mix uh, chopped corned beef with coleslaw and horseradish. Then we put that in the fridge to chill. Now to cream cheese, we add crushed pineapple, snipped dates, milk, and get that work together. Now we put this in the fridge for a few hours. So here's the deal. This recipe calls for a Frankfurter roll. Now, uh, my understanding is a Frankfurter roll is what they use for like a lobster roll in Maine. It's kind of like a hot dog bun, but it's really like flat on both sides so you can griddle it. Um, the only problem is I don't live anywhere near the East Coast. I live in San Jose, California, and I really couldn't find them uh, anywhere nearby me. So today I'm going to be using a hot dog bun instead. Eh. So now we're to hollow this out just a little bit. Then we fill it two-thirds full with our corned beef, coleslaw, and horseradish mixture. And the other end, put on our cream cheese, dates, pineapple. Then we close it up. And that might make you think, hey, wait a sec, how are we going to know which side is which? Well, on the savory side, a toothpick with a gherkin. On the sweet side, toothpick with a date. Okay, let's give the savory side of this two-course sandwich a go. It's pretty good. Corned beef coleslaw and horseradish, and that horseradish has a kick. Now let's give the sweet side of the two-course sandwich a go. That's nice. A little sweetness from the pineapple, sweetness from the date. That is actually quite tasty. That's a nice little combo. There you go. You got a full lunch. Savory and sweet. I do want to plus up the savory side just a little bit. I'm gonna throw that gherkin in. Oh yeah. Okay, let's give the savory side of this two-course sandwich plus up with the gherkin a go. A gherkin is, of course, just a miniature dill pickle. It's going well with the coleslaw, it's going well with the horseradish, going well with the corned beef. Mmm. All right, so the original two-course sandwich from 1958, the savory side of things, I would say, is probably about a seven and a half. It's a really good combination, the horseradish, the coleslaw, and the corned beef. The sweet side, also a seven and a half. The cream cheese, dates, pineapple, nice combination. Uh, plusing up the uh, savory side with the gherkin, Probably got it up to an eight. Definitely gonna finish it, and I would make this again, uh, but I would probably use different bread than a hot dog bun or even a Frankfurter roll. I'd probably use like a hoagie roll or something like that to really get a nice sandwich out of it. But yeah, tasty stuff. <laughs> All right, see you tomorrow.